Dodge Report. It is nearly Christmas, and then it is almost nearly New Year's as well. So today we ask the question, in 2012, will we learn to speak to animals? Because that is a natural question that occurs often when you think about things. Welcome to the Gradual Report, where we gradually report. In 2011, enormous strides were made in understanding non-human vocalizations. Consider what we've learned about dolphins. An acoustic engineer associated with the organization called Speak Dolphin, that's a real organization? Yes, it is. Really? Yes, it is has created an instrument called the Thiamoscope. With this machine, he was able to reveal the detailed structure that the dolphin's whistles seem to make. <whistles> Just kidding, that's crazy. Dolphins don't whistle that, but that is my favorite song to whistle. What they're saying is that they're gonna take the wish, the whistles, the dolphins make, and they're gonna couple them with all the actions that the dolphins interact with, and then they're gonna figure out what the dolphins are saying, because then we'll know. I'm gonna save the scientists over at Speak Dolphin a whole lot of time by just translating right now what a dolphin might mean. When a dolphin goes, <coughs> it's saying, I want more fish! Come on, more fish! And when the dolphin goes, <coughs> What it's really trying to tell you is, Tell me more fish! More fish! Why you stop give fish? I want more fish! Yeah. Yeah. Another mystery solved. By me. <laughs> Why are he taking my fish away? I like a fish! By compiling all of the information that we gather from our new machine and associating that information with what the dolphin is doing, we may be able to actually decipher what the dolphin is vocalizing. The researchers of the organization of Dolphin Speak remain confident that they may be able to one day decipher the sounds that dolphin makes and, with some specialized, highly tuned equipment, send some sounds back to the dolphin, thereby by enabling meaningful communication with them. Final summation. I love dolphins as much as the next guy, but I don't care what they have to say. I prefer to have meaningful conversations with my giant stuffed rhinoceros. What's that, Rhino Ricky? As always, I love you, my little lemon drops. Do join us on Friday when we continue our very important work. I just love that song!